of the year. A happy season of all. Thanksgiving's tomorrow, turkey day, we gotta get it, you know. Hey guys, it's Ashley, welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, make sure you go ahead and hit that subscribe button and the notification bell right next to it so that you don't miss any of my posts. Last time I was here was at the beginning of October, so it's going on two months since I last filmed a video. It's Thanksgiving day, and that means Black Friday is tomorrow. People have been in the Christmas spirit since October. Literally, there's people outside. My window's right over there. If you hear anybody, it's a bunch of kids outside. There's people putting up their lights and getting in the Christmas spirit and everything on my street. Street. so yeah all around good vibes over here so many new things have happened since I left we're on the road to 200 subscribers we're like three away so I'm so excited for that if you follow me on my Instagram which is at Ashley Tyler with two R's then you would have saw the poll I posted yesterday that was asking if you guys wanted to see my Christmas wish list or this video right here a lot of you chose this video right here I'm still gonna post both videos just because you guys want them both I'm filming this one first for you guys right now so that you guys know what to buy since it's Black Friday and Thanksgiving's tomorrow, Turkey Day, we about to get it, you know. So I compiled here a list of gift ideas. It's over 100. I don't know how much over 100. I just know it's 100 plus. So make sure you sit down and get ready. Get your notebook and your pen ready because I'm about to go in. I categorized most of these just to make it easier for everybody. We're starting out with stocking stuffers, which I made sure these were like $20 or less. So first you can buy fuzzy socks. People love fuzzy socks during Christmas season. It just makes the mood quite honestly. Nike socks, any socks, but Nike socks are becoming more popular, especially because people are getting Air Forces now and stuff like that. You can get face mask. Now I mean the face mask that you put on and you like wash off or peel off or whatever kind it is, but you can also get them face mask for COVID as well because that's very necessary for the time, especially since numbers are starting to go back up again. So it's just like, it makes sense, you know? You can get them scrunchies. I don't know if people actually still use scrunchies, but that used to be a big thing like two years ago. But you can always buy some scrunchies and people will be happy about it. Now, these are one of the things I want. I want a keychain. Um, I have a keychain already that has like all my keys and everything on it, but I do want a keychain that's like the off-white one, not a real off-white one, because expensive i don't even know if that's a real thing but there are people on etsy who are making off-white keychains and i really want one of them and they're like clear and i'll probably have a picture right here but that's what i want the black one specifically body lotions from like bath and body works right now they're having their like buy three get three free and they're like buy two get one free i do believe candles now here's the thing i'm not really into candles like that but i know my friend my friend's weird about this but she has she has a candle that's scented like a specific person. I think it's like Matthew Gray Goobler or someone. I don't know. You can get their favorite food. This is an obvious one. If you don't know what to get them, get a gift card because you never go wrong with gift cards. Whether it's a Visa gift card to go anywhere or if it's like a specific store that you know they like, then that's great too. Also, just get them a card and write something in it and put money in it. That's fine too. You never fail, you know? Eyelash curler, makeup wipes, mascara, lash extensions, lip glosses. There's some that aren't just clear, like there's tinted lip glosses, beauty blenders. I don't know if anybody uses these still, but pop sockets, that used to be a big thing a few years ago. And the last thing in this category I have is a clip on like phone ring light. So like a ring light but like for your phone, it just clips on. I don't really know what it's called, so I'm just gonna call it that because I don't know the official name, so. So this next category is like clothing and shoes and accessories. Anything you can wear pretty much is what this is. Doc Martens are really good right now. They've been in for like two, three years now. The ones that I personally like the best are the platform ones. I think they're called like the Jaden Doc Martens. You can also get the ones without the platform. I think those are called like the 1460 something. Some numbers are in front of there. I don't know. Air Force Ones, Jordan Ones. Those really became popular this year during quarantine. Air Force Shields. These are what you put in your shoes to make sure they don't crease. I didn't know that before. Like, I didn't know that was a thing. Like, somebody told me in my comments that that was a thing. I don't know if those shields can really, like, save my shoes, but they already have creasing in them. So I'm pretty sure it's too late to save them, but I wish I knew that before. I didn't know that was an actual thing. You can get them Vans. I prefer the platform ones. Converse, you can never go wrong with Converse. Any artsy girl likes Converse, so 
If your friend happens to be an artsy, different, quirky person, then they probably like Converse and that's just that. Nike. So I preferably like the Air Max 270s. They're just running shoes, but any Nikes, basketball shoes, you know. Boots. Uggs I found to be the most popular. Ugg slides on the other hand. Ugg slides are expensive for no reason. Like they're cute, but like I don't know if I would pay over a hundred dollars for them. You know, it's just not it's not my thing. Birkenstocks. I have fake Birkenstocks from Walmart because Birkenstocks for a hundred and whatever, however many when I could get Literally look at these, okay? These are my fake Birkenstocks from Walmart. They cost like $11. And they look pretty much the same. Get the ones from Walmart, I'm telling you. A lot of people like Crocs, I'm just not into it, but there's the regular ones, there's the fern line ones, or you can get them the little giblet, what, giblets? Is that what they're called? Giblet things that go in the Crocs. Hoodies, crew necks, mini backpacks. I have a mini backpack, it's just a Nike one from Urban Outfitters. Purses, you can find a lot of these on Depop if you're into like vintage stuff. Bucket hats, I don't know if you guys are aware but I'm obsessed with this bucket hat. I used to hate bucket hats so much and despise them and I was like, why would you wanna, I don't know, I just thought they were ugly. But then I bought one and I was, I never take this thing off. If you go to my Instagram, every picture that's been recent is this I'm wearing this bucket hat. Even my profile picture, I'm wearing this bucket hat. I never take it off. Beanies since it's almost winter. It's getting really cold outside over here. I live in North Carolina and it's like cold every other day. If you live in North Carolina, you already know it's bipolar. Sweaters, sweater vest, graphic t-shirts. Especially if you know they have like a favorite TV show, then I guarantee you they're gonna love you forever because graphic t-shirts, TV shows, Puffer jackets, I used to hate puffer jackets anytime my mom bought them because they were just big and I never used them and to me they were ugly. But I think the cropped ones that are like coming back in style, I think those are cute. Sweatpants, jeans, so whether it's like skinny, um, people aren't really into skinny jeans anymore. I own so many skinny jeans, but you can get the mom jeans if they're into that, boyfriend jeans, the whole family like. <laughs> Anyways, belts. I personally think Urban Outfitters has the best belts. I have like five of their belts. I'm obsessed. This belt I got from them, guys, I'm just saying, I'm just saying. If the people you know are into working out, you can get them workout clothes, whether it's from like Gymshark, Lululemon, Fabletics, merch. People have been really into YouTube, Twitch streamers. They've been finding new people to love over quarantine. So if you know that they love a certain person, then you can buy their merch. You can get them custom jewelry. Like whether it's like their birthday, birth year, the astrological, astrology sign, horoscope, whatever the freak you call that, their name, like any jewelry, but if it's custom, then it means way more. Earrings. My piercings are literally closing up like, Sunglasses, even though nobody's wearing sunglasses right now, unless you're just trying to look cool. And, okay, so guys, I haven't told you guys on YouTube yet, but if you follow me on Instagram, once again, or Snapchat, link in bio, or link in the description, you know I have a brand now, and it's called Gorzimo, and I am a co-owner of it. I own it with my friend Alexander Stelly. We opened maybe two weeks ago. Um, the website's currently down just because of like some problems, but it's gonna be up and running eventually. I don't know when eventually is, because anytime I say something's happening soon, it's not. So, you can go to our Instagram, it's just Gorzimo, and I'll link it down below. We have been working on it since April, and we didn't tell anybody until a few weeks ago. So, I hope you guys like it, and you can do some Christmas shopping, and um... Yes, I own a brand now, because I'm obsessed with clothes. He likes clothes, he likes making art and stuff, so we came together to make a brand that we both can appreciate and love. And you can just go to our website, it will be opening soon. We have everything on there, and if you go follow the Instagram, we'll let you know about new updates, new releases, new items that are coming out and stuff like that, and just everything about us, so go follow us. Anyways, back to the video. Now we're going on to the electronics, AirPods an AirPods case, a new iPhone. You can get them the 12 or whatever. I think the 12 is ugly, and not worth your time. I have the 11 Pro, a new iPhone case for them. I have a wildflower case and I've had two wildflower cases and I think that they are the best cases you can get. I have this one for my 11 
And when I had the 6S, I had this one. And they collaborate with a bunch of creators to make beautiful cases. So I think you should go buy their cases. Their cases are like $40 or so. They're like $30 to $40 depending on what like what size your phone is, but you can get them at iPad, the normal one, iPad Pro, iPad Air, iPad Mini. You got options, you know, so you can do that. You can get them a case, you can get them the keyboard for it, you can get them an Apple Pencil. It's like a stylus, but that Apple Pencil I think costs like over $100, maybe $200. I'm not actually sure. I'm gonna have to research that, but it's a crazy amount either way. Apple Watch. I personally don't care for the Apple Watch because I already have a phone, so what's the point of the Apple Watch? All the Apple Watch does is tell people to breathe, and I already know when to breathe. An Apple Watch, man, they have so many to choose from. MacBook Pro, you can get them, was, is it Final Cut X or Final Cut Pro? It, it's the editing software that you have on the MacBook that costs like $200, $300. You can buy them that. A GoPro, get them a Canon. G7X, mine's the Mark II. I think there might be a Mark III out or something. Get yeah, a tripod. I just have one from Amazon. It was really cheap. A ring light. PS5, those are selling out so quickly. If they're not a PlayStation person, you can get them an Xbox Series X. That's the latest one, I do believe. A Nintendo Switch, that's way less expensive than all the rest. I think that's like $300 compared to like $500. And you can get them video games for any of the consoles they have or anything. You can buy them a TV, a JBL speaker or any speaker if they want to like play their music loudly. And speaking of music, you can get them Spotify Premium, Apple Music, whatever they prefer. I prefer Spotify Premium, but a lot of people like Apple Music. So you can get them like movie subscriptions. So like Netflix, Hulu, Disney Plus, YouTube TV, all the rest of those. A Polaroid camera, a disposable camera, an Amazon Echo, Google Home. This category is kind of shorter because I didn't really have much to write for this, but there's like cosmetic stuff, eyeshadow palettes, makeup brushes, makeup mirror. You can get those makeup mirrors that have like the light built into them. I think those are really cool and some of them are like adjustable and everything. Literally any makeup product ever, foundation, concealer, if they use it a lot and you know they need it refilled, just ask for their shade and be like, here, you know? Curling wand for their hair. You can get them a flat iron, straightener, or whatever the freak you call it. Hair products, like if they use gel in their hair, then you can get them gel. A bonnet, hairbrush, a hair dryer. Mm -hmm. Of the year, happy season of Wrapping it up here. You can get them skincare stuff. This is the last category. I don't really have a specific name for this, so I just named it other because I didn't feel like fit in any other category. LED lights, an LED sign. I have one over there that says love and cursive. I don't really know what to call it. It's like a projector thing for like at night. You can like show stars on your ceiling. It's really cool. Books if they like to read. Or you can just get them like fashion books, like one that says Prada on it or something just to look cool. A diffuser, a salt. Is it called a salt lamp? It's like the orange lamp that has like the light in it. You can get a card, like the brand that your car is, you can get a light for it for like the doors so when you open it, like it has the, Y'all know what I'm talking about. Anyways, you can also get a car rear view mirror thingy. You know how people like put the dice on their like um, rear view mirror and it's like, I don't know what those are called, but that, that thing. Coasters, like for their cup holders. There's like some that are like on Etsy that are Louis Vuitton. They just look cute. I think it's just a way to spice up your car. Skateboards or longboards. If you guys haven't seen my skateboard before, this is it right here. It looks plain on the front says blind. This is a good brand to get if you are looking for skateboards. If you know that they're into sports, like if they play volleyball or basketball, get them stuff related to their sport. So like I play volleyball, like a volleyball, knee pads, ankle brace, literally anything would be useful and I'd be thankful for it. So you can get them a sports bag, like a duffel bag thing, either like a backpack or like just to put all their stuff in, like if they're going to practice or something. You can also get them a water bottle. You can get them Polaroids of famous people. Uh, a lot of people still have that clear phone case that they like put a Polaroid in. And I think it'd be really cool if they had like somebody they liked. If they're into art, like paint brushes, paint, coloring supplies, literally anything in that realm. These I find so cool, but I don't know who exactly I would do it with because I have so many friends that I would need like 20, like 30. 30 of them long distance touch bracelet stuff it's like a bracelet that you and somebody else has it could be your boyfriend your mom your 
sister, your best friend, whoever, you get it and if you touch it, they feel the touch. So it's like a touch bracelet. It's like a bond, I think it's called bond or something. There's websites for it, but I think that's really cool. I don't know how much those cost at all because I haven't really looked into it like that. The Hall Raven <laughs> backpack. It's like French or, oh wait, no, 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 it's not French, it's Sweden and I don't know how to pronounce it. I wanted one for the longest time. If I get one now, I'd be so excited. I'd rather get the mini one though, just because it's mini. Many things just happen to be better. If they're into traveling, you can get them a suitcase. You can get them board games. A custom Spotify glass. I love these so much. I wish I had one. But basically, I found this person on Instagram. Um, I'll put their tag right here. They make custom Spotify glasses. You've probably seen them a couple times, but it's like a glass and it has like a specific song or whatever and the Spotify code so if you scan it with your phone on Spotify then it will play the song and I just think it's really cool and everything. This is kitchen stuff. You can get them like a mini fridge. I feel like those are expensive. Not really sure. Keurig coffee maker if you guys are like if they're into coffee or anything like that. A waffle maker or there's like mini ones that you can get. They're like really cheap on Target. They're like $10 or something like that. I need to cop one of those when I'm going to college because about to be making waffles every day. You can get them a blender also, like a, what is it called? Like a Ninja or like a Nutribullet or just any, any blender. You can get them a record player. These go for like $99 on Urban Outfitters. You can get vinyl for the record player. So if they already have a record player and you can just buy them like their favorite songs or albums or whatever. Last but not least, you can get them a record player shelf. So to put all their like records and everything and be organized, so. Thank you guys for watching my video. Really appreciate you guys the most. We're almost at 200 subs, like I said, at the start. Anyways, make sure you follow all my socials. Those are down below. Also, make sure you go and follow Gorzimo. That's my clothing account with Alex that I was talking about earlier. And I will see you guys in the next video. Bye. Guys, I just turned on the freaking camera because I cannot believe what I'm seeing right now. When I was filming the video, we hit 200 subscribers. I have to make a speech. <laughs> like, thank you guys for 200 subscribers. I can't even speak. Thank you guys for 200 subscribers. It really means a lot. So thank you to everybody who subscribed and I hope we keep growing. When we get to a thousand, we're doing a giveaway. It's gonna have multiple winners and everything because you guys deserve that. I don't even know what to say. Thank you for 200 subscribers, everyone. And I hope you have a happy holiday.